Outlook uh, area, so we're looking at Bluff here, that's overlooking the Missouri River. I wanted to uh, take a minute to uh, kind of talk about the recent flooding uh, that took place here in March. probably change the, uh, some of the habitat uh, that, that the Sea Tonga has here on the Omaha Res and these low hills. Some of those things that they were doing along the river probably has gotten flooded out, so uh, we may see them uh, more in the timber area um, that we're going to be going into. So I just kind of wanted to point that out, that this recent, recent flooding may have uh, kind of dislocated uh, some of their uh, inhabitants where they were living and may end up uh, having them on the move more. So uh, just kind of an interesting um, view of what floods can do to, to the habitat and to land and the, to the animals that live within these forests. But uh, it was a devastating uh, flood for most of the farmers in this region. Uh, many of them lost, uh, along the Missouri River, lost all of their land. And then there was a lot of uh, bridges that have gotten washed out uh, that still need to be replaced so uh, a tremendous amount of damage farther up from here where the Niagara River gets into the Missouri River uh, that entire dam was destroyed so there was significant uh, change here in the ecology around the river and this is where the Setonga lives so I just kind of wanted to make a video here and show that see if I can get behind me here if you can see the river back behind me that's, that's the Missouri River, and this is a, a bluff in the Lost Hills on the Omaha Reservation. This is Richard Soul with International Hominology in the land of the Giants. Barry and I are here at the tree that we just uh, set up with lard, and uh, we put some up probably nine or ten feet, nine feet probably up in the air, and then some probably about four feet. And then underneath of it, we have uh, put the tape, which is a packaging tape, that we are hoping to get some uh, hair samples and uh, this area, we found structures. We found a structure right next to this tree. And so we're real, uh, really anticipating, uh, hopefully getting some hair tomorrow once we come back here. Barry uh, did talk to the, the sea tonga here. They said, hey, uh, they acknowledged him when we came in here. And uh, we've had some wood knocks. It's been a very positive experience. 
And so we are very hopeful that we, we've left this gift of lard uh, for them, that this will be uh, respectful enough for them, and that uh, tomorrow that they will uh, have some hair for us. So uh, this is uh, Richard and Barry here with the Red Squatching International Hominology, Ahu, in the land of the Sitanga. It's May 3rd, Friday, uh, 2019. I'm here at the Omaha Res, Res Squatching Research, uh, at the Setonga Crossing here. Um, we're getting ready to start our expedition, and I thought I would stop and take a look here. It's in the spring, so we've got still some uh, foliage behind us uh, here that's starting to come in the trees. Um, we've also got this sort of uh, landscape that's off the Riparian Forest that is here off the Missouri River and we have these roll we have these hills and bluffs they're actually a uh, system of Los Hills that are uh, bluffs along the Missouri River and they've got uh, a lot of these sort of uh, ravines that are located if you look behind me you can see uh, looks like there's an arch uh, tree structure here in this ravine. So um, there's a lot of activity in this area. This is called Setonga Crossing because uh, we've had a lot of interactions in this location, Barry has especially. Uh, so just thought I would stop here and uh, kind of take a look at um, what the, what's going on uh, along the, the bluffs here as I head into Big Elk. And I'd like to set up um, a sticky trap here uh, this afternoon where we will um, put some uh, lard or um, base, bake, bacon grease, basically, uh, and some sticky uh, tape uh, around the trees and try to get some hair samples. So we're looking to try to get some hair samples for international hominology. But uh, this is the... The uh, Lowe's Hills uh, on the Omaha Reservation with the 2019 expedition. And this is Richard Soule uh, in the land of the giants, Setonga. Ahu. Okay, Barry and I are here at Camp Hard Knocks and we just set up another sticky station here for tonight. This is uh, the 3rd of May already. So we're here with Red Squatching and uh, we're gonna go ahead and try to get some hair samples. We set up another one earlier and we're real hopeful that tonight it's gonna be uh, real beneficial for the research with DNA. Anything to say about it, Barry? No, I'm, I'm excited. I, I, like, I, I like the plan and uh, we're just gonna keep the faith and, and hopefully things work out, man. That sounds good. Uh, Ahu here at Camp Hard Knocks, and uh, we're here in the uh, land of the Setonga.